A magic balloon. Rub a balloon on your head to create static electricity. Place against a wall and let go. The balloon sticks because the negatively charged particles in the balloon attract to the positively charged particles in the wall. And that's how you make... What color do you get when you mix red and blue? Well, normally you would get purple, but watch this. Why aren't the colors mixing? Well, these waters are actually different temperatures. The red water is hot, the blue water is cold, and temperature affects density. The red hot water is less dense than the cold blue water, so it's able to stay on top. Try it for yourself and follow for more science videos. I got this question a lot, so let's see what happens. I only pulled the card out halfway to help you see the movement of water more easily. As you can see, the cold blue water instantly moves downward and warm water rises up. Eventually, heat is evenly transferred through both jars and you're left with purple water. Try it for yourself and follow for more science videos. The water bottle has been in my freezer for about two hours. It's almost cold enough to freeze, but it's still in liquid form. However, when I slam it on the counter, a process called nucleation occurs, which means the entire bottle crystallizes and freezes. Try it for yourself and follow for more science videos. A floating band. Cut a circular strip from a plastic grocery bag and blow up a balloon. Rub the balloon and the band on your head to create static electricity. Since the balloon and the band are both negatively charged, they repel each other, causing the band to float. And that's how you make ice cube challenge. Can you get an ice cube out of a cup of water without touching it? You can with the help of science. Drape a piece of string across an ice cube, add some salt, and wait for one minute. The salt causes the ice to melt a little, but then the ice quickly refreezes around the string, allowing you to pick it up. And that's how you do this is a rocket book. It's a reusable notebook. You write in it with friction pens and then it can be wiped clean with a wet cloth. If you want to save your messages, you can scan them straight to your phone. This is one small way you can save the trees and save the planet. No matter how many times I try this, it still blows my mind. As I pour water into this glass, the arrows change direction. This is because as light travels through water, it refracts. Additionally, the curved glass acts like a lens, which is similar to how your eyes work. If you try this for yourself, use a curved glass, hold the paper a few inches away, and follow for more science videos. Fire extinguisher. Add vinegar to a bottle and funnel baking soda into a balloon. Place the balloon on top and lift it up. When the baking soda and vinegar mix, it creates carbon dioxide gas, which fills up the balloon. Carefully release the carbon dioxide into a container and pour it over the candles to extinguish them. Carbon dioxide suffocates the flame and causes the candles to go out. And that's how you make I'm gonna put this candle completely underwater, but it's not gonna go out. Watch. This is possible thanks to air. The air in the cup takes up space and protects the candle from getting wet. However, if you hold it underwater for too long, it loses its oxygen supply and burns out. Try it for yourself and follow for more science videos. A bubble machine. Cut off the bottom of a plastic bottle and cover with a sock. Add water and dish soap to a tray. Then place a few drops of food coloring directly on the sock. Finally, dip and blow. And that's how you make these are erasable pens. Their ink reacts to heat. When this card is heated by the candle, the ink disappears. But will it work in a microwave? Let's find out. Heat waves travel from the microwave to the paper and cause the ink to disappear. Put the paper in the freezer and the ink cools and becomes visible again. Try it for yourself and follow for more science videos. Rocket. Thread some yarn through a straw and hang it tautly. Tape an inflated balloon to the straw and let go. And that's how you make. You get the egg into the water without touching it. Right now, the egg is not moving and it wants to stay that way. When you hit the pie pan, the cardboard tube moves out from under the egg. 
Inertia keeps the egg suspended for just a second and then gravity pulls it into the glass. Try it for yourself and follow for more science videos. This is ferrofluid. It's a liquid full of magnetic particles. When placed near a magnet, spikes form, allowing you to visualize the magnetic field. Ferrofluid was created by NASA in 1963 to help move fuel through space. Try it for yourself carefully, because this stuff can get messy. And follow for more science videos. candle challenge. Can you blow out a candle behind a jar? Place a round jar behind a lit candle and forcefully blow. The air from your mouth bends around the jar and causes the candle to go out. And that's how you do This is a chain fountain. It's also known as the mold effect and it's possible because of momentum. The beads inside the jar are traveling very quickly upward while the beads outside the jar are traveling very quickly downward. The higher you hold the jar, the higher the fountain will rise. Try it for yourself and follow for more science videos.